So where this guy's supposed to be? According to this bullshit map she gave us, we're supposed to meet this guy at the park in between 4th and Dixon Street. What? Good job, dickweed. Why the fuck did you take the map from me? So I could see where we were going. Well, if you could see where we were going, then you wouldn't have hit him. He wasn't there when I took the map from you. We better call her. Census Bureau, Carrie Ann Booth Bay speaking. We've run into a problem on that special assignment. How big a problem? I don't know. About 300 pounds. What does that mean? What did you do? We hit a human speed bump. He's in the back of the car. Are you kidding me right now? I need to know what you want us to do. <sighs> Go to Foster's funeral home and talk to Cynthia. I'll let her know you're coming. She'll take care of it. Will do. <sighs> How may I help you, gentlemen? We hear about the accident. Uh, I'm sorry? Yeah, the accident. The speed bump? Speed bump? Yeah, big old speed bump. Big and sloppy. Huh? Look, there's a dead guy in our trunk, and you're supposed to take care of it for us. The body's in your trunk? Yeah. Carrie Ann said to bring it here and to talk to Cynthia, and she'd handle everything. Cynthia, she stepped out for a moment. Uh, I'm Esther. Can't believe you told her about the sloppy speed bump. Forget about her. We're supposed to be at the spot by four. That gives us a half an hour. What if you didn't run your mouth in there, we wouldn't have two speed bumps to slow us down. Shut up! Man. How should I do it? Should I do it all ruthless like and shoot him in the face? Or should I hold the gun sideways like a gangster? Put this shit down, we're in public. Come on, man, which way makes me look cool? <laughs> Motherfuck you, bitch! Oh, man, did I just shoot you? What's it look like, you ass? Man, you don't have to talk to me like the speed bump lady. Shut up and give me a hand! Everything all right? I heard a ruckus over here. Yeah, everything's okay. I just shot him a little bit. That's Slavinsky. <laughs> I'm coming back for this. Please be careful, it's the last one. <laughs> So did you get him? No, I lost him. Damn man's like the fastest man alive. Now what? Forget this shit. Let's go get paid. Yeah, help me up. What the hell happened?
happened to you two? We hit a few bumps on the way. Yeah, drunk ones. So what do I owe you? Twenty-five dollars? Thirty? Wait a minute. We kill a drunk. We kidnap your make-believe funeral home lady. This asshat shoots me in my knee. And you only offer us twenty-five dollars? I chased an Olympian. Damn near decapitated myself. And the bastard still got away. It's gonna cost you at least seventy-five. He got away? Yeah. I went chasing after him. The snake didn't help at all. Should have seen him sitting by the car all shot in the leg and stuff. Do you realize what you've done? After the day we've been through, I don't give a shit. You don't understand. Ted is the most vile human being I've ever met in my life. He's always walking around the office with this false sense of entitlement, this overblown ego, and worst of all, what pisses me off the most is he always takes the last fucking jelly donut in the break room and I never get to have any of them. Fat slop, I hate him, he ruins my life. And you fucked up the perfect opportunity to get rid of him. You mean what we went through today was over fucking jelly donuts? Yes! Gangsta style.